Today we're going to learn how to use the new thermocouple modular DAX. And you can see it's here. The way this works is you see there's, so you see there's ports 0 through 9. 0 and 1 are for the first thermocouple. 2, 3 is thermocouple 2. 4, 5 is thermocouple 3. 6, 7 is thermocouple 4. But the numbering starts as this is 0, 1, 2, 3 with the standard uh, NI numbering. Now port 0 is positive and port 1 is negative and the numbering continues so 2, 4, 6 are all the positive ports and 1, 3, 5, 7 are all the negative ports for the thermocouple. Now the thermocouples we typically use is the T-type and some of them have connectors on it so if you have a connector on it you're going to have to remove it. So you remove it by just unscrewing the terminals. Now for the T-type couples you can see how they connect. This silver one here is negative this coppery colored one is positive. Now if you have a different type thermocouple like a J or K you can find out what's the positive and negative port. Um, one way to find out is just to connect it to the DAC and then run your VI and see if you get the correct reading for temperature of the room. It should be around the temperature of like 20 degrees. It shouldn't be like 90 or negative something. So if you run it, you may be able to find out if that's the correct polarity. If not, flip the polarity and then go from there. So for thermocouple 1, which is the first thermocouple, you can hook up up to 4. You go ahead and put the silvery cable, or the 1 port, tighten the screw up. And then in the 0 port, you put the copper colored wire and then go ahead and screw it up and then once you have that connected then you connect the other end to the USB port and the USB port to the computer and that's how you connect the thermocouple to the DAC so again if you have a different type thermocouple like a K or a J type and not a T type you can look up what's the positive and negative cable coloring and if all else fails and you can't figure that out, then just connect the thermocouple, run your DAC, see if you get the correct temperature. If not, then flip the wires, flip the polarity. So if you plug in, say you put the copper in zero and the silver in, in one, and you're not getting the correct t temperature, then flip the copper to one and the silver to the zero port. So again, that's how you use the DAC.